Hello and welcome to Cataclysm Part 10. So I noticed something and that is that, well there's a plop there. Um, I have no water, no way of making water, and there's no water on this farm. So that's kinda bad. And there's a blob here, which means there are more blobs probably. Although I can't see where they would come from. So this farm is not a good place to be because the blobs are gonna eat our faces during the night. Okay. Well, I'm just going to uh, kill these. Okay, there we go. Actually, how's my cutting? 72. Okay, cutting weapon 72. It's going up pretty quickly. And then there's a book that has a minimum skill requirement of 1 and trains cutting weapons up to 4. So that that's probably what I'm going to read pretty soon to use my machete. And, uh, we're gonna go back to town and visit probably some of the places at least um, definitely the electronics store and what else is there libraries now nah. a bar liquor store yeah that's that's what we need as well and it's getting late so driving will be a bit dangerous But hopefully nothing bad will happen. Uh, the reason I want to go to the electronic store is because we need some components. Um, I have uh, figured something out. We can do... Oh. So now I have to go through here. Carefully. Having that spike is very useful because it allows me to see a bit with a bit more accuracy where exactly I'm going. Uh, otherwise, you know, as you might have noticed, there are more degrees of uh, of turning than you know just three uh, tiles can display. So, for example, if I'm going a bit left, you can see that you know the the uh, it's still pointed right down. What's this? Oh, food. Okay. Um, stop and get out. So, you know, the more tiles you have, the more accurately you can see where you're going. A lot of food, that's good. And some water as well. Uh, and I am tired, but uh, we will have to ignore that. Do I have a flashlight at least? No, that would be far too easy. Yeah, so I think if I added a spike to the back as well, that would allow me to see even better. And uh, I'm not really sure how I'm going to get to the city like this. I should put on my raincoat because it's uh, raining. So I'm not sure if this was a good idea. Well, I could go down, down, no, that's the swamp. Well, this is great. What are the chances of me not actually hitting something? Probably not. Oh. Uh, and I fell down. Okay, well. Actually, let me check. Yeah, the spike has taken some damage, but that's all. So, we're still safe. So, back, and then... Yeah, like that, and cruise control. And now we can get around the bush. There we go. So, I'm not very far in. I think the spike will probably die. I can only see one square. Oh, crap. Well, that's what you get for trying to bike around at night. Let's go back. And now forward. Oh, OK. 
careful. Another shrub. Where? I don't even see it. Um, so I guess I should go... No, not like that. Okay. Oh. So I'm going the slowest that this bike can actually get, or at least the cruise control can get, because this might give me enough time to actually see what I'm hitting. Okay, so... Oh, that was a stone, actually. And uh, a spider die. Okay, there we go. Oh, there's the road. I can see it on the minimap. We're actually going to make it. Oh. Hmm. Provided we can avoid things like that. Okay. Come on. Yay, there's the road. I think this one leads, yeah, this one leads into the city. That's good. I'll just follow the... Let me eat my chunks of meat. There we go. And there's another thing following me. A cougar. Okay. I think I have to get, uh, take care of that one. Wow, I'm pretty good at fighting. And now let's go into the city. So we're going to go to the electronic store and try to pick up some uh, RAM and a processor board. What else? Uh, oh. And uh, that's actually it. We might, I might get some other stuff as well. Actually, oh, okay. But that's mostly what I want. Okay, let's actually stop here. And uh, it's actually raining acid. That's never good. And I would like to find a flashlight. Because it's dark. I've been here before, apparently. Oh, there we go. Flashlight, okay. Is it, uh... Didn't I pick it up? I don't see it. Uh, no. Okay, there we go. Yes, it's, it's powered. Okay. Anything else? A pot. Yes, that is exactly what I need. And a frying pan. Uh, actually, I think. Let's just let's check. Volume eight, weight six. Okay. Volume six, weight six. But I think uh, I think the pot is used in more. Oh, more recipes. Whatever. I'll just keep both of them for now. Ooh, and a bottle of whiskey. That's good. Now, if I, I could just find my bicycle. Uh, activate flashlight. There we go. And now we want to go... No. No. Two police stations. There. Liquor store. Okay. So, down from the past the gas station. There's the motorcycle. Oh. Zombies that I haven't taken care of. Okay. And... Uh, I should... Uh, drink. Okay. And actually, take some first aid, probably. Torso. And uh, right leg. Okay. And some more zombies. Uh, 
I should repair my stuff. Sewing kit uh, repair. My skirt. That's a smoker zombie. I am not willing to fight that right now. Oh, crap. <laughs> Watch out. So let's just go. And I think that's the liquor store. Great, I cut myself. Okay, well, I'm just gonna take a lot of these bottles of alcohol. Mostly just uh, the high, high alcohol content stuff. Because I, what's what's triple sec? Hmm. Gin, rum, sure. Uh, I don't drink, so I, I don't even know what a lot of these are, but I think whiskey has a lot of alcohol, right? Uh, we need this, these to recharge our energy for implants. Because we're going to be needing it. And vodka should have a lot of alcohol as well. Tequila, we're not taking that. That's disgusting. Uh, I'm actually overburdened, so... Let me drop my chunk of meat. And also, let's drop the frying pan. The frying pan is in the liquor store. It's important to remember this, if I ever need it. So these are some seats, I guess. Let's just find the bicycle again. A hammer. Ah, oh, okay. Sure. Uh, electronics store. There it is. Okay. Uh, where's the zombie? Oh, there it is. Okay. Well, let's just hit it. Good. Uh, I'm pretty sure... Oh, there's a bear there. Okay. Come on, zombie dog. Fight me. On the bush. They're doing some pretty decent damage to me. Uh. Okay. Okay, so I'm actually in pain, so I'm going to take some aspirin. There's not a whole lot I could have done about that, so whatever. Come on, zombie. There we go. Uh, this is the electronics store. And there's a jumping spider inside. <laughs> of course. Why wouldn't there be? Good. Now there's no jumping spider. So we're gonna take, uh, let's see, RAM and batteries, uh, flashlight. I don't have the volume uh, processor board. That's, that's exactly what I need. Uh, some more zombies. This is a shrub, right? Yep. Come on, zombies. There we go. How's my cutting weapons? It's one. Okay. So I'm going to unload a lot of this stuff to my uh, my box. Uh, no, not the Adderall. That can stay.
hammer as well, obviously. Uh, the pot can go... Okay, I have lots of space now. That's good. We're gonna take some of the stuff. I don't need it for our next mission, but you never know, maybe. Oh, hot plate. Okay. Uh, soldering iron, sure. Let's see, some batteries. Batteries are always nice. I haven't really been using batteries, but... Uh, more RAM and more processor boards. MP3 player, sure. Some copper wire, uh, more more components. Signal receiver, I don't think I need that. Let's see. Two-way radio, I think you can disassemble that for some pretty good items. Uh, RAM, sure, copper wire, I think that's just generally useful. What's USB drive? I don't know what that does. Lots and lots of stuff. Not that I mind stuff, you know, but... Hmm. Okay. Oops. Uh, flashlight, sure. Flashlights are always welcome. Transponder circuit. I think that's something for radios. Uh, we don't have a radio, but... I mean, we have no use for a radio. I think... Like in the game, there's going to be factions and stuff, and you can, you'll be able to call them for help. And actually, there's a screen. Let me just. Ooh. No, no, no. Where is it? No, no. So it's not one. It's not two. Ah, there we go. Factions. So these are randomly generated. I think. Uh, right now they don't do anything, but once the NPCs are in, uh, it's going to be more fun, I guess. Although this is fun, you know, it's just survival uh, on your own. There's merit in that. Uh, anything else? No, don't think so. The bank might be interesting. Okay, so now we need to get home. With a flashlight, it, sh it shouldn't be too difficult. Actually, I should turn it off while I'm on the road, because... There's nothing really on the road to watch out for. And I guess I'll just... Uh, where do I... Well, I might as well just go straight up. Yeah, it's getting really, really dark. Uh, where is the middle of the road? No, that's not the middle. I think that's it. So we're just going to travel. And this is where having driving skill really pays off because... Uh, you know, I don't have to fumble around. I don't have to watch out for where I'm going and we're making some pretty decent pace I think there's a motorcycle here that I left <laughs> which I wouldn't want to hit but I think I uh, I put it on the parking lot I think okay so it's midnight and the uh, the field of view expanded a bit I think that that happens because there's moonlight or something Either that or it's a bug. What? Bite wound. Oh. The dog must have bit me. That's not good. I think I know how to fix that though. But we have to get, uh, we have to get back. Actually, apply, uh, Hot plate. Yes. There we go. I fixed it by 
cauterizing myself with the hot blade. And now I'm in a lot of pain. And uh, that would be bad because I'm slowed down, but um, because I'm on a bike, it doesn't really matter. So, okay. Uh, I'm cold. Yeah, it's 18 degrees. That's, you know, and a thunderstorm. I can see how that could be cold. Although I do have a raincoat. Uh, there should be, a, yeah, a bunker. Time to turn on the flashlight and get off the road. Almost off the road. Okay, there it is. Good. Now I can turn it off again. And now we actually want to go just like this. What's that? Tra oh. Uh, oh. Oh, right. Stop. <laughs> wow, okay. I was lucky. Ah. <sighs> Well, if it wasn't for the moonlight, uh, this bike would end pretty badly. Cougar, okay. Can I kill it in my state? I think so. There we go. With a little bit of luck, I'll be able to get back home. Although, I guess I could have stayed in one of the houses in the city and then gone back uh, during the morning. No! Okay. Uh, is the vehicle injured? No. Okay, that's good. Uh, there's another cougar. I should probably just get rid of it before it upsets me. Uh, cruise control back. Not really the direction I want to go. So reversing is a bit odd. Uh, it acts the opposite of the way I would expect it to, to act. Oh, don't hit. Oh, come on, go down. There we go. Uh, up. Okay. Down. Oof. That was close. Okay, another road. So, the next one, we go down. How's the flashlight? Ah, oh, it's fine. Wasting a hundred ba- well, using, I guess, a hundred batteries to safely get home is not so bad. It's not a waste. Oh, and someone said uh, that if you just kind of wander about in the sewer, in the sewage, uh, you get good mutations more often than by taking uh, mutagen potions. So that's that's something cool that I'm going to try out at some point. Uh, but not right now, because we have a mission. We have a definite mission. I'm going to reveal it in just, just a bit. <laughs> Uh, once we get home, I guess. Uh, careful. There are a lot of bushes here. I think the spiders are actually following me. So I'm going to escape quickly and close the door. 
<clears throat> Although they can still get in through the window. So. Oh, is it? I'm. How am I wet? Oh, they destroyed my raincoat. Oh, that's. That's crappy. Do I have another one? Rain. No. <laughs> okay. And the flashlight is giving out. Um. I should just sleep. Yeah. So you're gonna see me how uh, sleep here. I closed all the doors so wildlife can't get in. And then I sleep. There we go. And my torso is really badly injured apparently. Or something else is going on. No. There we go. It's healing, uh, even though... Uh, have I woken up? No? Come on. There we go. Wow, it has, actually it hasn't healed completely. That's crazy. I have very fast healer. It should It should have. At least I feel it should have. So the first thing we're going to do is hunt for some animals. Uh, this there. Yeah, should I waste it there? Maybe. Come on. There we go. I'm pretty good at this now. A sinew, you can use that instead of thread. Man, I really should have repaired that. Ooh, too much. Uh, I should have repaired my raincoat. Okay, and now we're gonna make some, really? I'm very thirsty and I'm too, too sad, too depressed to make water. So I guess I'll just take some water here. Uh, that's one of those things that I don't really like. I think I said that actually. Wow, I'm minus 100, I'm extremely sad. But I want to craft. Okay, I'll wait an hour. That was actually too much, but okay. Uh, we can't make this yet. We need a vacutainer, but we can make... I can see how it's laggy. Um, an electro hack. So you can see a processor board and RAM. That's what we needed. And now we have it. Okay. Uh, I'll use the soldering iron, I guess. Uh, and the copper wire. There we go. And this allows me to hack doors. Oops, what what did I do? <laughs> I'm gonna drop some stuff now. Um, yeah, these, these, these. Okay. Uh, the flashlight, which doesn't work anymore. The hot plate. And the batteries. Actually, what I'll do is I'll drop the flashlights that do work. And keep the batteries. And all the other stuff goes as well, if I can actually find the key. Uh, you know what? Whatever. The transponder circuit can stay because I can't figure out which key is, uh, is the dash on my keyboard right now. And I'm not going to waste my time. Uh, oh, there we go. Royal Jelly. If you don't want to you know, hurt yourself. You can just eat that and it cures a lot of stuff, including, I believe, a bite wound. Do you want to make some water now? I don't have a pot. I have a pot in my bike, though. Uh, all of this can stay i guess actually let's let's drink some whiskey i'm thirsty okay 
and also wasted. I need water. God damn it. Uh, let's just drink it. Actually, no. Uh, my morale is pretty good, <laughs> so we can we can make some water using the hot plate which I dropped somewhere. Where is it? I should not have dropped it. Okay. So the problem is that uh, only a certain number of items can be on one square, on one tile, so there is hot plate. Well, there's one of my hot plates. Um, yeah, so they spill over, make the clean water using the hot plate, put it in the plastic bottle. There we go. Uh, do it again. Okay. Sure, make some more. We're going to be drinking a lot. Whatever. Okay. Okay. D. D. Oh, I can't finish it all. That means I wasted some of it. So not, my power is 60 now. I think I can actually go a bit higher. 62, 67, 70, 74. Okay. How, how, wow, I have a lot of power. I didn't even know, <laughs> I didn't even know that. Uh, e. Uh, I don't know what that is. I think it's something to do with the terminal that I'm using. 108. I think that's all. Apparently, because it didn't increase. So, I mean, I guess I could get some food poisoning. Sure. Uh, oh, uh, use the blood filter. Good. See, and now my and my stats were actually like zero, literally zero. So, uh, okay, should I? Uh, yes. Ah, uh, food poisoning. Okay. Well, whatever. So now we have an electro hack, and there is a bunker here, up here. I haven't visited it yet, but we're gonna go there. And I am going to show you something, something really cool. If I can actually manage, if I don't die, I might, you know, there's always the possibility. I think those, yeah, those are the rocks I dropped. Okay. Ah, he's really happy. Yeah, enjoyed the whiskey, even though I filtered it out. So, uh, drinking is a very effective way to restore your energy. I drank one bottle and it almost fully restored my energy, so. Uh, oh. No? Okay. Still a bit drunk, apparently. Okay, we just have to make it to the bunker. That is our goal. And hopefully there's not nothing scary here. As there tends to be. Uh, yeah, up. There are some craters here. But that's okay. I don't mind craters. And these are just rocks, I think. Oh, those are giant worms, I think. Uh, well, there there are mounds of dirt, but there are uh, giant worms under there, so that's bad news. But. My bicycle is quite fast, so... Giant worms can be pretty annoying. But we are almost at the bunker. No, actually, we're not. Uh, oh, okay. 
Ooh, another giant worm. Okay. And I am nauseous. nauseous. Well, that's just life. Ah, here we go. So now I just have to make it through these trees. Ooh, what's this? Oh, I had the filter on. Right, that's why I'm not seeing anything. Kevlar vest, you know what? That sounds like an awesome idea right now. Uh, where is it? Oh, it's... It's inside. Hmm. Should I do it? Sure. Oh, I cut my arm. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna wear that Kevlar vest. Okay. Sure. No turrets. No turrets. Okay. So here's the door, right? We don't have any military ID cards anymore. But if I examine it, Oops. If I examine it, I can use the electro hack. Uh, oh, do I want to do this? Hmm. Actually, what I want to do is turn on. Or maybe not. I don't know how many turns it takes to hack. So, <laughs> actually, let's just do it. Yes. Okay. And now, turn on the the uh, the cloaking system. There we go. You can see my character is now gray. Oh, look at those, look at those turrets. There are actually six turrets in here. Um, very dangerous. Now I can turn it on. Or off, I mean off. And let's turn on the flashlight and see what we have. Ah, that's, that one's dead. Uh, let's reload it. There we go. Oh, implants. Hmm, let's see. Diamond cornea, what's that? Enhanced hearing. Well, let's just... Open all of them. Huh. Li oh. Okay. Come on. Yay. <laughs> and we're inside. We don't need... That's useless. Uh, we don't need uh, cards anymore. What is that? Ooh. Okay. Plus two bonus to perception. I will... Accept? I don't know. Should I? I will, we'll just wait a bit. Yes. Do it. Uh, what's this? Inactive man hack. Okay, so that's like you you can deploy. Ooh, wow! You can deploy it and uh, it will be like your ally, I guess. Wow! Ooh, that is a lot of stuff. Oh, a plasma rifle. Awesome. Hmm. So I'll just open all of these because I can. Why not? Uh, open. There we go. Oops. Come on. Nothing in there. Uh, yeah, so this is how you can get inside. You just need an electro hack and some pretty high skill in electronics, I think. So this is the rail gun. Let's check it out. Developed by some German company. Okay, so it's a railgun, whatever. Uh, that's not super useful to me right now. What's the other one? The plasma rifle. I've never actually seen that one before. It's very heavy. Okay, it heats hydrogen to create plasma and envelops it with polymers to reduce blooming. Okay, short range. Hmm. I don't know how much damage these do because it doesn't actually say. It says how much damage to do on the ammo. Is there like hydrogen here so I can see? No. Hmm. Well, this is pretty cool actually. So now in the future I can go into all of these Maybe even off video, actually. I don't want metabolic interchange. Why does the game keep keep giving me that? I don't want it. Wow, it, it actually gave me two. Well, thanks, game.
and two fusion arms also not so great enhanced hearing mm, my hearing is 10 times better than the average person this could be good I don't know this is a passive I know that much let's just install this one plus two to perception so you know like I said uh, you can only have uh, 26 implants I don't know if that's a limitation that's supposed to be there or it's just you know no one is supposed to get that many uh, no one was expected to get that many I guess uh, yeah, so I'm already on N. I don't know if I want to waste my slots on these. They're kind of mid middling, I guess, you know. They're not awesome, but they're not bad either. What's in here? Some supplies and stuff. Uh I think I'll go with the uh, plus two to perception because right now with eight perception I can't actually see landmines. If I had a perception of ten, that would just allow me to see them. So that would be pretty good because I don't really want to step on a landmine. That's a bad way to begin a day. There's nothing really in the weapons that I want. I mean, at some point I might come and. Well, I'll, I'll pick up this ammo, actually, because I have a gun that fires this. Hmm, that's a lot of stuff. Yeah, I have this gun. And I think I actually gave it uh, a suppressor, didn't I? Anyway, I'm going to go back, uh, you know, consider what I'm going to take here and then go back to the base and regroup a bit and then I am going to take my jerry can and go back to the farm so I can actually refuel my vehicle effectively uh, without breaking the pump um, anyway thank you for watching and I will see you next time